guess there's someone at the door. So, I just got a package. I wonder what it could be. I hope you like it. <sighs> What's good, my ninjas? Jay Kraken coming at you on a vlog. For once. For once. It's been so long since I made a vlog, since I've talked to you guys through the lens of this camera. I miss it. I hope it looks cinematic. I love vlogging, but I just haven't done so in a long time. Today, I'm coming at you with something pretty special, because I don't really do this often. I have an unboxing of some dope-ass Overwatch merch. I can't wait for you guys to see. Um, and I think I might do like a little bit of a review. So this is going to be like an unboxing review. Actually, no, I don't think I'm going to review anything. I'm just going to be gushing over these products. Also, I want to let you guys know that I faked you out. Like, I didn't actually wake up today with like a package waiting for me at my doorstep. I've been sitting on this package for like two weeks now. Actually, closer to three weeks since I started working on Black Watch Boys, which, by the way, for those of you who have checked out Black Watch Boys, thank you so much for the support. I was super nervous, like, rapping on that, but I'm glad you dig it, and don't think it was, like, like over 9,000 cringe, just, like, 11 out of 10 cringe. So, that's pretty rad. Every ounce of restraint inside me to not open the box and tear it open, just because I think I know what's inside. There's some pretty dope ass Overwatch merch in here, so I can't wait to get into it. Right there is actually a box for it. Because I got a cat. I'll get I'll show you the little kitty later. I think she's asleep. Before I dive into this box, and I know I'm kinda of stalling here. I've been stalling myself for like three weeks trying not to like open this. I have my exacto knife, like ready to just like rip into this box. But before I dive into this unboxing, I have to give a huge Huge shout out to my man, Rob from Fanfic Gaming. He was a dude that sent me this awesome care package. Uh, he's the one that runs Fanfic Gaming, and he's like, yo, Jay Kraken, I wanna hook you up with some cool things. So, bro, thank you so much. I'm excited to dive into this. If you guys are unfamiliar with Fanfic Gaming, you might have not heard the name before, but chances are, if you watch Overwatch content on YouTube gaming, or on just YouTube in general, you might have seen his products floating around like content creators' videos. So Fanfic Gaming is based in Canada, and right here you see like an examine by sticker. It means that someone went through this box and was like, who the fuck is this Jay Kraken kid and why does he have shuriken? What is he, trying to be a ninja? I don't know. Whoever looked through this box, I hope you don't judge me, bro. I just like Genji and I like shurikens. Okay, I don't want you to see the address, you feel me? Ow! I just cut myself! That's what happens when you're too excited to open these boxes. I like stab myself. Good thing this blade is dull. <gasps> Yo! My ninjas! Alright, alright, yo, let's check this out. One last thing before I get into this unboxing, I wanted to introduce you to a little friend of mine. She's very shy, but like I said, I got a new cat, and this is my first pet ever, and I haven't named her yet, but I'm thinking of uh, Jana. She's gonna help me unbox all this Overwatch merch today, so let's go. That's actually so cute. I might I might not be able to unbox this from cuteness overload. So I have this thing like opened up. My ninja, my ninja, my ninjas. We have these bad boys right here. These are the Genji fidget shurikens I was talking about. And it looks like FanFit hooked your boy up with two of them. I'm really stoked because one of them is the original skin or the classic Genji skin shuriken from what it looks like. Yo, and then of course there's Tracer on the back. That booty though. I think this one is um, Bedouin, the Bedouin Genji skin shuriken. Or actually no, this is uh, this is Young Genji and Sparrow Genji's shurikens. I've been wondering why fidget spinners are so popular, so we're just gonna break into one of these and give them a try. Okay, this is, oh, sh that was great. All right, so here we go, my ninjas. Fidget spinner, you go like that, just twirl it around. Is that like a skateboard bearing? I think there's like skateboard bearings in there. That's really cool. Why do people like these things so much? I'm not sure why people are so about them, but... Okay, that's actually kind of cool. That's actually kind of cool. It feels like relaxing on your finger when you do it. 
I'm like a true Genji main now. Hold on, let's get the other one going here. Oh, dang. Okay. Now we have two shuriken. If this doesn't make me like a top 10 Grandmaster Genji, I don't know what will, guys. I have freaking shuriken now. These are gonna come in handy when we are queuing up for comp and it's taking forever because we six stack, you guys know that. So I think I can see why people like these things so much. Probably gonna get addicted to fidget spinners. I think I already am addicted. They're not actually like super sharp either. You could do this without like cutting yourself, but I feel like if you actually threw this at a wall, it would like dent the wall. You could do some damage. Whoa, that was scary. Do you guys hear that? I fucking shuriken. That was really creepy. I heard something like fall down in my closet. And my closet door is open, bro. That's kind of creepy. Anyways, guys, moving along. You? Whoa, he hooked it up with a ton of pennants. Or pennants or flags? What do you guys call these? I think they're pennants, right? First up, we have like these cool Overwatch logo pennants. This one's on, uh, it has the Overwatch logo on a dark grayish black background. Uh, and it's got a cool like 8-bit effect to it too. Like a retro like Mario sort of vibe to it. I dig it. I like the 8-bit aesthetic. And then this one does too. Only this one's on a white background. These ones are dank. You can't go wrong with these. This one that says Roar. Uh, I don't think that's... This is Overwatch. It looks like a knight. Or maybe that's Roadhog. I can't tell. Alright, so we got this one right here. We got your boy, Winston. For those of you guys who watch me on stream and have been keeping up with me on Season 4 Competitive, you guys know I've been playing a lot of Winston. He's like one of my mains now. And we got the Winston flag. I'm gonna put this one up for sure. I think it'd be cool to put it up on that wall, actually. I love this. Oh wait, this one's probably Winston then. That would make sense. I think that's Winston actually. And it says Roar. Cool, so we got a set of Winston pendants over here, which is really cool. Rob, good looking out bro. Winston main over here. Uh, next up, we have Die, Die, Die to all you Blackwatch boys out there represent. If you haven't done so, check out Blackwatch boys, but we have it right here, Die, Die, Die. And we also have like the little Reaper soul ball thing. Soul ball? Soul ball, yeah. A ball of souls that he just sucks on. Yo, my ninjas. Woo! Alright, I may be a Winston main, because you gotta know, Genji will always be my favorite character. Yuji no Kenokure! Genji Dragon Blade Pennant. This one is super sick. Um, last but not least, guys, we have uh, the Genji Light. And for this one, I'm probably just gonna like turn off the lights and plug this one in so you guys can get the full effect of how cool these neon lights are. Let's go ahead. It's kind of weird unboxing stuff when you have a little baby kitty on your shoulder. She's whispering in my ear, guys. You think I'm an amazing Genji main? Oh, you're too kind. Okay, cool. I'm gonna go set this guy down here. So, hold on. Ooh. What's this guy? So this is the base. This is gonna be the base of the light. A power adapter to turn on the light. And then, of course, last but not least, Oh, yo. I'm gonna be very, very careful with this so I don't break it. We have the Genji helmet, neon light. Mata, mata, mata. Hey guys, what's good? It's your boy Genji. So I'm gonna put this stuff away and then we're gonna go fire on this light. Moment of truth. <gasps> yo. All right, that's pretty dope. Poke, poke, poke. I need healing. These lights don't actually get hot. I'm just a huge fan of like vibe lights. I mentioned this in a previous vlog, but I could honestly spend hours on end in IKEA's lighting section. I could literally spend hours on end in this section here, just looking at lighting. If you look around my room, I mean, I got lights there, I got lights there, I got the stream lights, and I got that one there. And now I have like this dope ass Genji one to use when I'm playing Overwatch. And it just, so that about does it for this unboxing vlog. It wasn't really that much of a vlog, more of just like an unboxing and me fanboying over like the cool gear. I get why people like these things now. It actually feels kind of nice on your finger. Is that weird? Again, huge, 
huge shout out and thank you to Fanfic Gaming. If you guys are interested in picking up any of the merch I featured throughout this video, I will be placing my affiliate link with Fanfic Gaming in the top line of the description. You guys can check out what kind of merch they have there. They have like a variety of Overwatch themed neon lights if you're interested. If you shop through my link, I actually get a small cut of the profit as well. So you guys get some dank Overwatch gear and you also help your boy out a little bit. Alright, before I dip out my ninjas, I just want to say thank you so, so much for all the support these last couple weeks. It's been absolutely insane. We broke 20,000 subscribers on YouTube. The channel's been seeing so much growth and like, I, it blows my mind, bro. We broke 10,000 at the start of the year and now we're at 20,000 and I think we're on the way to 25. I think at 25,000 I want to do a giveaway, so stay tuned for that. Uh, if you guys have any cute kitty names for our little friend here, it's a girl by the way, she's a girl. Um, let me know in the comment section below. As always, be good, and whatever it is you got going on in life, make it a cracking one. I love you guys. Peace. Yeah.